Hey, hey, y'all. It's Michelle. Trying to get y'all pulled up. Y'all, I'm like less than, oh, I'm like 499 away from 30,000 followers. Can you believe that? You got your beehives? Yay! Did you like them? That was quick. You got them quick. Hello, hello. I saw that this morning and I was like, I did a little dance. <laughs> it seems like it's taken so long to get there, but not. You know what I'm saying? Like 30,000 followers is, is a lot. And I did it in four years, y'all. So, I have a lady who sent me a whole bunch of supplies and wanted me to make her a wreath with the supplies that she purchased. So that's what we're gonna do. Um, so she bought um, this awesome deer ribbon, the green and natural, um, the birch, and can I hold these all? And this one. So these are all awesome combinations. Sleet covered. Oh no. I do not have any dark purple Santas. So, those are the ribbons she bought. Um, with the deer head. Hello, hello. And all these antlers. She's like, make me a wreath. I'm like, okay. <laughs> so that's what we're going to do. Um, so I am using the oval board. That was her only request. Um, use the supplies I sent you and use the unique in the creek board. Perfect. So thank you so much, Maureen. I love y'all. So, let me bring y'all down, and we'll get started and see what we come up with. All right? Boy. There we go. So, I have already, I'm going to turn it over so you can see the back. What I did was, now I wish I'd had the natural pipe cleaners, but I didn't, but it's fine. You're not going to be able to see them. Um, so, I did every other going to the outside, the inside, outside, inside, all the way around where she found the deer head. I honest, it looks like most of these supplies were from Christmas and from Ashland is Michael's. So I'm assuming Michael's is where all of this stuff came from. Um, but hopefully she'll pop on and I'll ask her as soon as I see her, but I'm pretty sure it's Michael's. So that's how we did it. Now I am doing 10 inch poofs. Oh, hold on, I got my mesh all, all twisted. I'm doing 10 inch poofs on the inside and the outside, and then we're gonna come in with 22 inch cruffles. Now I did 22 because I was just gonna do a cruffle base, but then when I realized I had all this ribbon and the antlers, um, I needed a big base. So we're gonna make it as big as we can get it. Um, so then I was like, well, let's do poofs and then we'll add the cruffles on top of the poofs, okay? So I've already done the inside. 
let's go ahead and do the outside. Okay, so here's where I finished on the inside. So all I'm gonna do is take it to the outside. Just like this. So if you have a bunch of 21 inch mesh, it can be used on these boards. Hey, hey. Okay. Okay, so I've taken it directly to the outside and now we're gonna continue our poofs doing every other. Is still putting out Christmas, really? Okay, then I guess I just need to go. Cause, now she did send me this stuff um, right after the new year, so in January. So she may have still gotten it before everything else came out, but I don't know. All right, so we're doing 10 inches. So I'm just gathering it and we're gonna take it to our next pipe cleaner. You just brought him home. I'm glad he's home. Hello. If y'all would flip my boat, I'd appreciate it. St Michael still okay. I'm just gonna have to go. I keep saying I'm not going because look, y'all, look, I don't need anything. But <laughs> you don't know what you don't need until you go, right? <laughs> I might need it once I get there. Hello, hello. So this will go pretty fast. Oh, you've been dealing with shingles? Gosh, I am so sorry. That stinks. I worked with quite a few patients who had shingles. Y'all, my daughter actually got um, shingles in her eye. And she's pretty much blind in her right eye. So I know shingles can be awful. Down the canal. That's awesome. <laughs> Jean, get it together, girl. <laughs> and she's young, y'all. I mean, she's only, she just turned 26. I do have an affiliate. Um, I will put it after the live. Or you can send me a message and I'll give it to you. Um, but make sure when you're using my affiliate that you use in the discount bar five off boards and you'll save 5% off your board order. Yeah, shingles can be very painful. Imagine getting it in the eye. I mean, Taylor would just be in tears because she'd be in so much pain. <laughs> Jean. <laughs> you had them all over your face? Ugh. Thanks. Yep, she got it in her eye. 
Oh, I know, Deb. It was in the 70s. Y'all, be, we've been running the air conditioner for the last couple days. Um, and it was in the 70s this morning. Um, and then within like an hour and a half, it dropped. I was like, uh, what happened? <laughs> How's the chicken pot? Oh, yeah. Yeah, they they really wanted to do a cornea transplant, but they couldn't guarantee that she couldn't get it again in that same eye. So she's like, why would I do it if there's no guarantee and it could attack the new cornea as well? So... She didn't get her cornea transplant. Um, but trust me, it doesn't stop her from doing anything that she wants to do. <laughs> yes, you can get them more than once. We used to have patients come in all the time. I, I think I've got the shingles, but I heard you couldn't get it twice. And I'm like, uh, yes, you can. All right, so we're white back, white, we're white back to where we started. <laughs> How she was 24, 23 or 24 when she was diagnosed with them. So she was young, young. All right, let's go ahead and unpoof our poofs. Ice on the roads. Ugh. Yes, Mother Nature just needs to get over it. You never had the chicken pox? Yeah, she definitely trusts. She doesn't. She does what she wants for sure. She doesn't let it stop her. Although it does scare me when she drives at night. Because <laughs> I'm just like, oh. All right. Let's poop the inside. So we have a nice big base, y'all. This shingles on your head. Yeah. Now the VA just gave me the shingles vaccine. I was like, I'm not old enough to get it. <laughs> it still hasn't dawned on me that I'm like 53. <laughs> In Texas. I am just south of Houston. I'm right between Houston and Galveston. You wish you were 53 again? Better get scheduled, right, Irene? <laughs> Got shingles on her foot? Yeah. It happens, y'all. It stinks, but... Okay, so we got from... We went from... Let's see, what did we go from? We went from a 23-inch base. I keep getting snagged. To... A 29 inch base and that's because we used we didn't use the regular holes we used going to the inside of the board and going to the outside of the board okay so that gave us a, a, an extra inch or so that we wouldn't have gotten otherwise okay so now we're gonna go through 
And I do have most of these cruffles done, but I do have two. So if you've never seen one, I will do a couple. You're hibernating. <laughs> so 22 inches. And I'm just folding one side over on itself and clipping it. Doing the same thing on itself once, and then I go one, two, grab it. You'll be 72 in nine days. Awesome. And you can either put them in like this with the curl up or down, whichever you prefer. Mine usually end up going up. So we're going to put one of these. So I actually undo my tie all the way and I go right down to the base. There were a lot of birthdays today. I, I try to wish everybody a happy birthday on whoever's on my text notifications. And there were quite a few today. So if you want to get notified when I go live, all you have to do is text me at 281-502-2228. Um, I do notify, um, well, when my kids come out, the VIP gets first picks. The, um, the text, whoever's on my text messaging app gets second dibs, and then they go up on my main page. So, if you want to be second to get notified when I go live, and when new products have hit, then text me. Hello, hello. You, you turned 62 on the 8th. Happy birthday. It is. It's really full. And it looks even bigger because we use the outside and not the typical holes. But we've got a lot going, a lot of ribbon going on this wreath. Um, so there she is. Sherry, 281-502-2228. Um, so, Sherry, they want to know where you got this deer head. Was it Michael's? It looks like that's where you got these other supplies, so I'm just checking. Your birthday was the 21st. Happy birthday. This board is called the Oval Board. It is from Unique in the Creek. And I will share my affiliate after the live. Oh, Craft Outlet. Okay, Craft Outlet, y'all, for the deer. Y'all, I hardly use pipe cleaners anymore, and they're kind of hurting my hands. <laughs> my hands aren't conditioned to, the, to using them too much anymore. You have a confession addicted to your flower sunnas. <laughs> I am too. I love making them. And the new ones I just came out with, oh my God. To see them in person, 
I mean, you can't never take a good picture of something like that, right? They're always better in person. So to see them in person, I'm just like, oh, it makes me sing. I am. I am putting them in every pipe cleaner. So if you can see here on the back, I went every other outside, inside, outside, inside, all the way around. So it ends up, I have 20, um, 20, uh, 20 ties, okay? Yeah, I thought, I saw the picks were from Michaels. I assumed they were Michaels, but I wasn't sure about the deer head. Look, Tina's on it. There's my affiliate link. Now remember, use five off boards in the discount code and you'll save 5% off your boards only. Not on any other supplies, just the boards. You need a mint green? I don't have a mint green. I have a green that's really, really pretty, a green rhinestone, but it's not a mint green. <laughs> Y'all know I like my big wreaths, and you can make them on these boards, I'm telling you. <laughs> JWPO is good. <laughs> he is good. He's getting to be a handful, y'all. And that boy, I cannot keep strawberries in this house. So I order groceries every Monday. And if you eat it all by Tuesday, you aren't getting it again until the following Monday. So I bought three things of strawberries because I knew um, he was going to be here Monday. I bought three things of strawberries. Y'all, they're already gone. He eats strawberries. He won't even let me wash them, y'all. He eats them right out of the thing before I can even wash them. I'm like, Bleh. <laughs> But he can eat some strawberries. My website is monkeyscreations.com. And if you'll remind me at the end of the live, I'll go grab some of those sunnas. I've made up all the orders except the last couple that just came in. Um, and I just need to box them up so they're not finished. But I can show you them. He will have a strong immunity. Yes, he will. Ooh, I just gag. I'm just like, bleh. <laughs> Oh my God, y'all want to hear something else? Horrible, horrible, horrible. So, who remembers our hamsters? Our hamster fiasco. It's kids because we ate dirt, right? <laughs> Do any of y'all remember the hamster fiasco? Well, if you didn't, quick recap. We had Nico and we had Jackson. Uh, no, it was Nico and, yeah, Nico and Jackson, I think, um, that were both supposed to be boys, right? Well, Jackson turned into Jasmine because she ended up having like 12 or 13 babies, okay? So, y'all know we got the hairless guinea pigs. Now, the first one we knew was a boy, okay? We found the second one, because everybody needs a, a buddy, right? We found the second one. This other pet store, the not the same pet store we got the hamsters from, another pet store, and I asked them three times, y'all, you better make sure that's a boy, because I know for sure we have another boy at home, and I'm not having babies. Oh, I promise, I promise it's a boy, blah, blah, blah. Well, guess what? I think Neo, short for Neapolitan, because he's three skin colors, I think is a girl. And I think she's pregnant. Yeah. I'm not happy again. <laughs> like, after that, I'm done. I am done so 
we are going to get hippie fixed. Did y'all know you can get Benny Kenny Pigs fixed? You can. So hippie is getting fixed. <laughs> I'm like, oh my God, no. People, which website is yours? Monkeyscreations.com. Oh, yes. So Taylor brought him in. I was working at the kitchen table last night, and Taylor brought him in with a big old belly. Now, I feed him every day, but normally that one's still kind of skittish of me. I don't know why. Hippie will come right up to me, um, but Neo doesn't for some reason. Um, so I hardly ever see him because he's always hiding until I leave the room, and then he'll come out and eat. So she brought him, actually picked him up and um, brought him to me last night. And I was like, no, Lord, please tell me no. <laughs> so, yeah. I keep freezing. Of course I do. Tell them child support, right? <laughs> They're like, he's just so young that, you know, they haven't come down yet. Blah, blah, blah. Um, uh, yeah, no. Gullible me believes them, thinking they should know what they're talking about, right? Yeah. Never again. Never again. All right, we've got one more. No, two more. Two more, two more. Y'all, I got to yapping. But at least I'm still working, right? Not freezing for y'all. I have to get... <laughs> oh, my God. And y'all, they eat. Holy man, they eat. But y'all, they are the cutest things. If y'all have not seen a hairless guinea pig, I, I did a video showing them um, right after we got one of them, or both of them. Um, go look at those videos. They are adorable. Chili and baked taters. I don't know what we're having. Y'all, I've cooked every night this week. Now, now, I've heard, Carrie, that the guinea pigs don't do that. Hamsters do, but I've heard that guinea pigs do not. Um, but I have heard also that you need to take the male out because right after she delivers, she can get pregnant again. <laughs> but I've heard that, that they do not eat um, their own like hamsters do. Right, Debbie? We'll be seeing candy things for sale, right? And y'all, them things ain't cheap. I paid $168 a piece for them things. Well, my daughter bought the first one. I bought the second one. But I was like, holy man. Hello, hello. Okay, so now we have our big old base, y'all. It's so big, I can't even get it all in the picture. There we go. Guinea pig. A oh, really? I don't know. I read a lot of articles yesterday after Taylor showed me Neo. And they said they wouldn't, but to take them out so that she doesn't immediately get pregnant again. Yes, Irene, hamsters will. Yep, if you have to take that male out immediately, or he will. All right, so we've got our tails. And this is the top of our board. So what I like to do what I remember is I'll take an off pipe cleaner like this and I'll mark it. That way I always know 
where my top is. I don't always do this, but I try to remember. <laughs> At least I know. <laughs> okay, so I am doing every other. So to incorporate all the ribbon that she wants in here, we're doing every other with the green and the deer and the the birch every 30 days lord have mercy and this one okay so we're going to do every other and let's hope i can keep this straight okay let's put this one over here this one over here <laughs> y'all. I'm so not happy. All right. So I'm going to take one. Now I'm going to put the deer on top. So I'm just placing one over the other. If you keep your top on, you'd know where it was. <laughs> oh gosh. Okay. Find your middle. Now this ribbon, because it's directional the way it is directional, um, there's just no way, unless you actually cut them in half again, that you're going to get them both going the right way. Okay? So I'm putting them in here and I'm giving that pipe cleaner a good few twists. And we are going to cut them off because we are not going to need them. Actually, let's wait. Y'all know me. 20 rabbits? What? Well, and that's what, you know, some people keep saying, put them outside. And no, you can't put hairless guinea pigs outside because... Um, Uh, they don't have hair to protect their skin. They'll get sunburnt. So, we can't have them outside. every other like this hey y'all if my internet goes out somebody message me <laughs> so I know it's gone out yesterday I was just a talking away and didn't know that y'all weren't even there anymore lunch is over oh no <laughs> Have a Noah's Ark. Oh my God, y'all stop. <laughs> y'all, I also want, y'all have so many wreaths I want to make. I want to do a tulip. Maybe I'll have time later today. Um, Diane, oh my God, I was. I was just talking away and I heard my phone ding, so I knew somebody messaged me, but it was in the kitchen, so I didn't check it. And it was, it was Dana telling me that, um, Y'all weren't there anymore. <laughs> Get some fresh air. Oh my God. Oh, really, Michelle? Oh my God. Back to work. Back to work. So I'm thinking, this is my top, so I'm thinking we're going to put the deer head right here in the middle um, and then put the antlers throughout. Y'all, I really need to clean my table.
So when the, when the comments quit scrolling, I get worried that I'm not live anymore. So y'all have to continue continually type something so I know we're still going. Because it looked like my whole system that I was still live. I couldn't even tell. Good. The deer head she said came from Craft Outlet. Now this is a box, this is an order that a lady sent me. Um, she's like, make me a wreath. <laughs> I was like, okay. Um, so these are the supplies that she bought that she wanted incorporated into her wreath. So I'm just making what she sent me. And I like that. You know, there was no guesswork. I knew exactly what she wanted. I just needed to know what base. And we were good. done y'all I promise only kind of deer <laughs> right And it's actually good quality ribbon for, for Michael's ribbon. I'm actually impressed. Fourteen inch tails. Now I'm only using fourteen inch normally. I would use sixteen inch tails, but because I did a poof with a cruffle on top. Um, I don't need that extra because it's not the I'm putting it more towards the top and not down in further than I normally do so I just use 14 inch tails does she want a bow she's getting a bow her only request was the unique in the creek board Will I be stocking more pink there? Ooh, I haven't had that kit in a long time. Um, poly burlap is just so expensive right now and so hard to get a hold of. Um, Pudic for me, awesome. <laughs> um, what was I saying? I forgot what I was saying. Hello, hello. How big is the mesh? I use the 21 inch mesh using 10 inch poofs, and then I use the 10 inch mesh with 22 inch cruffles. Yeah, poly burlap's hard to find and it's expensive. And getting more expensive, y'all. But I haven't had that kit in like two years, I think. Okay. 
and jute does spray don't worry about it just clip it off all right let's do the inside tails doesn't matter where we start so I'm just gonna start welcome welcome any no okay so who's new give me a thumbs up if you're new first time seeing me who, who, who? Oh, well, there's a few of you. Awesome. Welcome. I'm Michelle from Monkey's Creations. So if you have any questions, let me know. I usually try to catch most of them. First timer, welcome, Christine. And Di I'm assuming it's Diane and Maureen. Welcome, welcome. Thanks. So if you're looking for any other videos, I do upload all my videos to YouTube. So you can find all my other videos there. Not to be mean or rude, but you need a bigger table if you keep... May I know. I didn't know. I don't need a bigger... I actually have an eight-foot table, but it's covered. I just have this one spot. <laughs> I need to clean. I need to clean it up. I'm telling you. <laughs> oh, you're too funny. So I do have a huge table, an eight-foot table. <laughs> you need that dark purple what dark purple the light the, like the lavender purple get all these tails fixed and fluffed I promise if I get more cut now I you know I usually don't do custom gel um she uh this lady she she messaged me and I mean she had all of this stuff except the the base um and was just like will you make me a wreath and, and she shipped me everything, um, but I normally don't do customs. Janet? Mm-mm. Mm-mm. <laughs> Stop it. But the thing is, I have so many things going on at once that, y'all, I'm just... It's just too much. <laughs> But I did. I actually hired somebody to do all my packing and shipping. So, 
that will be one less thing I have to do. So he can be packing everything and shipping and I can just be creating. Go live. Needed, we needed to do something, and I kept trying. Cause y'all, y'all, I'm a look. Y'all know I'm OCD, so to give up power was hard for me. So I was like, "What is one thing that I can let go of that's really not going to bother me too much?" <laughs> and that was packing and shipping. Now, I'll still do, you know, some things, but he's going to do the majority of it. No, it's not Monk. <laughs> Lord knows what you'd get in a box. You might get a Pokemon toy, a Pokemon card. <laughs> Keep trying and trying. Never in a million years did I think that... Um, I would be where I'm at. But it's because of y'all. Y'all show up and support me and Mystery Box with Monk, oh my god. Inspection, yes! <laughs> in it. We cannot be friends. <laughs> no, I never want to be that big. No, I said, well, look, y'all, I'm, I'm too OCD, and I don't want to give up a lot of power, um, and that would require giving up a whole lot, so I don't want to be, I still want to be available and here. Aw, oh, thanks. I try, but you'll be surprised a lot of people don't like me. <laughs> they don't. I don't care. All right, I think we have one more. Now this one did take a little bit longer. I don't even know how long I've been live. Oh, it hasn't even been an hour. We're still good. Last tail going in. Yo, it's so windy, my trash cans, I can hear them. Gotta go to work. All right, I'll send you a picture, good friend. The deer came from Craft Outlet and everything else came from Michael's. This was a box that um, a lady sent me and was like, can you make me a wreath? So she bought all the supplies and shipped them to me. I like you too. <laughs> You'd be surprised, Courtney. <laughs> okay, so I am happy with the ribbons. Let's cut these off really quick. I don't know where my small things went. Maybe I can just use scissors and it'll go more quickly. 
So I'm just cutting off those pipe cleaners and I'm going to tuck it right down in so that you don't see them. I love y'all too. Actually, I am going to use these because those scissors scare me. I'm going to cut something that don't need to be cut. with the smaller ones than those big hoof cutters. <laughs> They're not really hoof cutters, but that's what I call them. Sees my comments. I, I just see you, Connie. I see you now. done. So we still need to make a bow. Just don't get a complex, girlfriend. <laughs> I, I do this to Monk all the time. I'm like, relax. And he'll be like, don't do it. <laughs> so I'm like, relax. But I can't say that without hearing Monk going, don't do it. You have a real job now? Is that good or bad? <laughs> good or bad? Okay. Let's fix. Whew. This one's wearing me out, y'all. Let me get all these antlers out of the way. And let's fluff these tails. Yeah, but I always hire you back. <laughs> Looks like a hot mess, y'all. But we're gonna fix it. Oh, he's calling me. Just dance to it. It's in the other room. I can't, I can't stop it, y'all. Just dance. Dance it out.
We have the same ringtone. <laughs> So she liked it so far until she had to leave. So I'll send her a picture. Now I'm, not, I'm still not going to fix them too much because we do still have to add the antlers. We have to add the deer. Um, we have to add the bow. And some people would say, why use all this ribbon? and cover most of that mesh and I say you can't have your ribbon set good if you don't have a, a good base so I mean you gotta have a good base if you were to put all this stuff on there and have it um, sit right does that make sense we'll have to dig yes Connie anytime thanks for the stars Sorry, there we go. Speaking of stars, <laughs> get to work. <laughs> Deanna is working on more stars for y'all. And ladybugs. So those will be available soon. Alright, so there's where we're at so far. So... The head, I'm thinking, is going to go right here in the middle. So let's go ahead and take How's it going to sit? It'll sit like that. So I'm just pulling the pick out of it because we don't need it. It has um, it looks like it was made for an ornament, so we're going to use that, and you're not going to see it, and we're going to go, see, I wish I had the natural pipe cleaners, but I don't. Do I want to use, okay, so I'm just going to run a pipe cleaner right through it. Give it a couple twists. And this is our middle. So I'm going to find through all this mesh. Let me take my glasses off.
over. Finger. Okay. Turn it back over. Let's see, we'll have to fix these tails again, but it'll be all right. I'll go through and definitely clip off most of these frays. I can go ahead and take this off because we definitely know where our top is now. And get that one cut off. Y'all, I've got my glasses off so I cannot see your comments. I'm sorry. Yep, a lady sent me this box and said, make me a wreath. And so she bought all of this. So. Right, let me see what that looks like. I want to make sure you can see those antlers. So you can definitely see them. So let's make a bow. And then we're going to incorporate the other antlers she wants. So these are the ribbons that she sent that she wanted incorporated. You just saw that I was live? What? So let me think. Now if it was me, I would have liked another one and a half inch ribbon. But we're going to make it work. And I only have one of these. And not a lot on it. So let me think, let me think, let me think. We have the antlers. We have the deer, so I don't think we need the deer ribbon. Let's do, let's do this on the bottom. Oh goodness, how much is left? We might have enough. Let's. You can tell I'm thinking, huh? Okay, we should have plenty. I'm going to do, I'm thinking I'm going to do two loops. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do two, one, two. So I'm going to do two loops of the green plaid, or buffalo check, whatever you want to call it. And then I'm going to 
do one. Oh, look, it's spliced. Don't you hate that? It happens, but... And then I'm going to do one. So I went six inch and then I'm doing about five and a half inch. And then I'm gonna do two. So we've got two at six inch one at five and a half, and then I'm going to do two at five. Hopefully. Hopefully, hopefully, yeah, we should have plenty. <clears throat> now, if we didn't have the antlers in the deer head, I would have incorporated that deer ribbon as well, but I don't think we need it. So I'm only going down about half an inch with each ribbon. And it's directional exactly now what I could do I could just do tails should I add the just the tails y'all think so I could do that add tails in the back Or I could just add one loop underneath. We can do that. Let's just add the tails. So because it is directional, I'm gonna cut them off separately. I don't measure my tails on the bow, I'm sorry. Um, I just try to keep them even. So I'm doing two separate pieces. That way our deer go face down and not up, okay? And I am No, I don't want it there. I'm going to put it back. So let's see. Let me see. Let me see. I've got to think. Let's see if I can hold all this. Lord have mercy. Don't lose it, don't lose it, don't lose it. Look, I'm not even going to chance it, y'all. Watch this. So we're going to give it a good twist. A good couple twist. Leave it open. Because my hands wouldn't have held all that for long. Tails going down and then add them right to the back of the pipe cleaner. I cheated. <laughs> 
It's not cheating. It's just making things work for you. <laughs> there we go. All right. And we're going to cut down these tails. They're probably way too long. But let's get it on our wreath first. Dawn, I haven't honestly even looked for it. An incorrect number for what? What's she talking about? Oh, my text. All right. There we go. Let's get all of this out of our way. Yeah, it's 281. Five zero two 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 eight. All right, so I'm thinking we're going to add this right there. going to pull it tight because I don't want my bow sucked down into all of that. So let's trim up our tails and then see how much shorter we need to make them. Sandy. She only comes in here when I'm live, y'all. <laughs> Painty. Oh. 
Okay, we're all on the right sides. <laughs> Yeah, it shouldn't matter if you're in Canada. It should work still the same. Because I know I have other Canadians on my app. Now I state Mill still may still cut down these tails a little bit more but I'll know more when I hang it up on my fence and take a picture if I want to cut them down some more. I've been live over an hour. I rarely go live over an hour, y'all. You love them? I like them long, too. Now, sometimes they can be, even for me, too long. Um, and I think this might be one of those cases. But I won't know until I get it hung up. All right, so there's our bow. All right, so all we have to do is add our antlers. I like spending time with y'all too. I really, really do. Now these are on wire, um, so they can be bent. So what I will do is I'm kind of angling them up just a little bit and now I will um, zip tie these in but for right now actually let me do cut these off just a little bit Ooh, maybe I didn't eat my Cheerios this morning holy man hmm Maybe we should have it coming out of... The bow. We've got two big ones. Let's have the big ones coming out of the bow. Now she has already gone or I'd ask her if she wanted all of these in. I don't think I'm gonna put all of them in, but when I send her a picture, she can tell me if she wants them all or not. How do these go? Like this. So let's cut them down. I know, isn't it amazing? It actually stayed on the whole time. Holy man. I don't know what kind of wire that is, but I need it in my bra. They're the same, so it's going to look off. No, that goes like this. No, it's still going to be off. Drunk thing pinch, oh my gosh. So let's use the big ones coming like out of the bow. <laughs> I do. Now 
there's gosh there's five of these things I'm not gonna use them all y'all so we have the two coming out of the bow that one in the right place Shall I know? <laughs> I always get patted down, and that when one of the guys the last time was like, um, it's it's because you have, and he was trying to be nice about it, but it, he's like it's because you have too much. You don't have a thigh gap, basically, is what he said to me, and I was like, God, I wasn't even born with a thigh gap. What you talking about? But that he did. He basically told me because my thighs rub together, I'll always get patted down. I'm like, you ain't even right. And let's put one over here. He did, y'all. I lie not. Boy. Uh. All right. Thank God this thing is huge, y'all. I can't even get it all in the camera. He get kicked in his thigh gap, right? <laughs> but I do have to, I will go in and um, I'll zip tie those antlers in and um, fix all these tails. Um, and then I'll try to get it outside and get a picture. But y'all, it's so overcast. It's horrible. It's rainy. It's cold. Um... But that's it. Get that bow fixed. You're driving me crazy. All right, so 10 inch poofs using 21 inch mesh, 22 inch cropples using 10 inch mesh, 14 inch tails, um, and uh, the oval unique in the creek board. All right, y'all. I know, right? Wait, can you see me now? Like, you can't even see me. Holy man. <laughs> All right. I am out of here. Y'all have an amazing day. Um, I feel like I was supposed to show y'all something. Was I supposed to do something? Somebody help me out. Thanks for floating my boat. Oh, the Santas. Y'all want to see them? Let me see. They're right here. The pictures just don't do them justice, y'all. So 
and let me just put them all down and then I'll show them. All right, so these are the new ones. This is the rose gold and silver rhinestone. Where's Waldo? <laughs> this is the blue and silver. Oh my God, look at that. Amazing. Um, this is the green with the blue. Perfect for a peacock, y'all. Peacock wreath is coming soon. This is the green with the green. And it changes colors, y'all. Can y'all see that? Amazing. Here's the orange. The yellow. Yeah, Kathy, I didn't pick out these. They were, the, the, the whole thing was just sent and was asked to make a wreath, so. The purple. Love that. And I love how it changes colors. The pink. And the light pink. But y'all, this, and I was showing Lori, because Lori has peacock mesh. Um, and she has this blue, y'all. So imagine a flower. You could do an all ribbon wreath with this, or the um the uh the peacock um oh i do have it ah with the mesh look how awesome that would be as a peacock flower but even the the all ribbon with these um would be awesome. Look at that. Oh my God, it's gorgeous. Gorgeous. So, you can get the the this ribbon, and she has a peacock mesh at Unique in the Creek, um, and then you can get the center from me and make you all kinds of gorgeous peacock or gorgeous flowers. I, I, I especially like the yellow. I don't know why. The yellow is my second favorite. But, all right, y'all. I am out of here. Y'all have an amazing day. And I can't even find my table. Oh, I can shut you off from up here. <laughs> so, y'all have an awesome day. And you, I, I might pop on later and um, make a tulip wreath. Um, a tulip on the ring board. Y'all want to see a tulip wreath? Um I know the blue, stunning. Um, so I may make a tulip wreath later, um, but we'll see. So if I see you later, I see you later. If not, what's today? Today's Wednesday, so no VIP till tomorrow. So I'll see you when I see you, but it may be later. Okay, bye y'all.